Lil Lodi was a rap star in the making. However, a tragic turn of events and a troubled history of his personal suffering brought about the demise of this talented young man. Very few can say that they walked in his shoes. Here, we dive deeper into the final moments of Lil Lodi's life and what ultimately led to his death. This is one of the craziest stories that we've ever heard in hip-hop, and it's nothing short of a tragedy. Lil Loaded, whose real name was Deshaun Maurice Robertson, was a promising up-and-coming rapper from Texas. He was born in San Bernardino, California, and moved to Dallas, Texas at age 10. While growing up, Lil Loaded had a challenging environment and had to adapt quickly. He came from the Rolling Sixties Crips, one of the oldest and largest gangs in LA, and had to navigate the streets. Tragically, Lil Loaded's older brother was killed when he was 15 years old, which deep affected him and pushed him further into the street line. After his brother's death, Lil Loaded took on the responsibility of being the man of the house and had to make sure everything was taken care of. He also experienced dangerous situations, including getting involved in shootouts. Once he was shot in the hand, but managed to avoid a more severe injury by quickly raising his hand to protect his face. Instead of seeking medical help at the hospital, he opted to have someone in the neighborhood treat his wound. Around this time, Lil Loaded started rapping and adopted the name Lil Loaded, which was a nickname commonly used for him in the neighborhood. In the recent years, the city of Dallas, Texas has seen a rise in its hip-hop scene, with artists like Post Malone, Yellow Beezy, and Mo3 gaining recognition. Among these rising stars came Lil Loaded, who burst onto the scene with his track Block Baby. He'd been making music for just over a year when his second song Block Baby started gaining traction. The journey to success was a whirlwind for Lil Loaded. After releasing his first song, which garnered a few hundred views, he stumbled upon a beat on YouTube that caught his attention. The melody and the energy just resonated with him, and he decided to freestyle over it. Little did he know that this song, which he finished in just two takes, would become his breakout hit. Lil Loaded shot a music video for Block Baby in his neighborhood, capturing the raw essence of his environment. The video showcased his authenticity and genuine energy, which resonated with listeners. Soon after uploading it to YouTube, the video caught the attention of a polished YouTuber named Tommy Craze, who reviewed videos with zero views. Suddenly, Lil Loaded's video was thrust into the spotlight, and within 24 hours, it garnered over 150,000 views. You know what? We should spot this block. What? Yes, of course. Yeah, what I mean? We've got to celebrate. We got to celebrate. We got to celebrate. Ain't no way rapper. Your favorite YouTuber and your favorite rapper at the same place at the same time in the same video. God damn! Yo, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back. Tommy Craze and Lil Loaded even met up later and did a video together, which they listened to some of Lil Loaded's music and did reviews on some other tracks too. The success of Block Baby attracted the attention of labels and managers, leading to a flurry of calls and opportunities. Lil Loaded's career began to take off, with subsequent songs like Gang Unit and Out My Body gaining millions of views. As his popularity grew, he faced the challenges that come with success, including jealousy and tension in his neighborhood. Despite the changes in his life, Lil Loda remained grounded. He continued to live in his neighborhood, staying true to his roots, and focus on making good music. His family, for the most part, supported his endeavors, although he encountered some fake attitudes along the way. Nevertheless, Lil Loda persevered, determined to reach the next level of his career. With his mixtape Block Baby, released in 2019, and another project titled A Demon in Blue, little after that, Lil Loda showed no signs to slowing down. He still sourced beats from YouTube as well as working with producers directly. His approach to music was true to himself, and he strives to maintain his unique style and energy. Following the success of Glock Baby, Lil Loaded continued to release music and collaborate with other popular artists. He signed with Epic Records and released his debut mixtape, also titled Glock Baby, in December of 2019. The mixtape featured collabs with artists like NLE Choppa, King Vaughn, Pooh Shiesty, and Hot Boy. Fortunately, Lil Loaded's rise to fame was marred by a tragic incident. In a somber turn of events, the city of Dallas was left in shock as Lil Loaded found himself behind bars, facing a grave accusation of murder. Lil Loaded voluntarily surrendered to authorities on Monday, following the tragic shooting of his 18-year-old friend, Khalil Walker. Before handing himself over to the authorities, Loaded went to his Instagram account and left a post that was addressing his fans and said, I appreciate all y'all support. They try to make you look guilty when you innocent regardless. We're going to get past this. RIP, my brother. Love you. 
Initially, there was some confusion regarding the victim's name, with authorities identifying him as Kalia Walker. However, the Dallas County Medical Examiner's Office later confirmed the correct spelling of his name as Khalil. As the community grappled with the weight of this incident, Loden's attorney, Ashkan Marari, refrained from commenting extensively on the case, emphasizing the need to gather more info and fully understand the circumstances. Nevertheless, he suggested that the charge against Lil Loaded might be disproportionate. The incident unfolded on October 25th, when the police received a distress call from a residence located on the 7200 block of Lost Canyon Drive nestled near the Cedar Ridge Preserve in the tranquil neighborhood of the woods in southwestern Dallas. By the time law enforcement arrived at the scene, Walker had already sustained a fatal gunshot wound to the torso from a rifle. He'd been rushed to Methodist Charlton Medical Center, but tragically succumbed to his injuries. According to an affidavit for Little Loaded's arrest, he, Walker, and a witness were present outside of the house at the time of the incident. Walker's sister, who was inside the residence, heard two gunshots and immediately rushed outside, where she encountered Little Loaded and the witness standing over her wounded brother sprawled out on the street. Reacting swiftly, she dialed 911 to report the shooting. Furthermore, she made a startling discovery when she examined Walker's phone and stumbled upon a video that implicated Loaded as the one responsible for shooting him. The affidavit continued, shedding light on the subsequent events. Allegedly, Loaded and the witness transported the injured Walker to the hospital in a car before returning themselves back home. After dropping off Walker, Robertson left the scene, leaving the witness behind. During the investigation, the sister of the victim revealed to the detective that Robertson was a trusted friend of the family, adding another layer of complexity to the already perplexing case. Adding a haunting dimension to the tragedy, on the same day as the shooting, Lil Loaded took to his Instagram account to express his grief, posting a message that appeared to mourn the loss of Walker. The post read, So much love for you. They thought we had the same mama. I'ma see you soon. Lil Loaded was held for a time at the Dallas County Jail, awaiting for legal proceedings. Initially, his bail amounted to $500 thousand dollars, but it was later reduced to 75k. Additionally, court records indicate that he was also facing another legal matter involving a misdemeanor charge for unlawful carrying of a weapon. The circumstances leading to the shooting were unclear, but Lil Loaded maintained that it was an accident while filming a music video with a loaded gun. In March of 2021, Lil Loaded was indicted by a Dallas County grand jury on a lesser charge of manslaughter. He was placed under house arrest while awaiting his court date. Amidst the legal troubles and the weight of the situation, Lil Loaded struggled mentally and emotionally. On May 31st, 2021, he tragically took his own life through a self-inflicted gunshot. His death came as a shock to friends, family, and fans who saw his potential as an artist. The devastating news unfolded when his mother made a distressing call to the police, discovering her son's lifeless body with a gunshot wound to the head. From the very moment she found him, she knew the source of his anguish. According to the obtained police report, law enforcement authorities in Cedar Hill, Texas, swiftly responded to a reported incident of attempted suicide. Side. Upon their arrival at the residence, Lil Loaded's mother was found on the front porch consumed by tears, while the lifeless body of the rapper lay inside the firearm found nearby. During the investigation, the police noted that Lil Loaded's mother revealed that she had returned home to find her son in the second floor hallway. Furthermore, she recounted that she had been visibly emotional that previous night, expressing his distress through tears and anguish, primarily related to the deep feelings of his former girlfriend. Lil Loaded's attorney, Ash Khan Mirari, also suggested that the rapper took his own life. This tragic event occurred over the holiday weekend casting a shadow of sorrow over the rising star's promising future. To make matters even more chilling, Lil Loaded posted an enigmatic message before his untimely passing. Cryptic post by Lil Loaded included heartfelt words stating, Dear Most High, please forgive me for my shortcomings and all of the times I've felt short of making you proud and being appreciative of the blessings that have been put in my life. Sometimes the lines are blurred between being solid and being heartless. I want to thank you for how far I've come and the people you've put in my life to keep me grounded and humble through everything, and I love every single one of those people that are genuinely for me. I ask for entrance into your kingdom through all of my mistakes. I know you love all your children, and I'm ready for my heart and soul to join you. He seeked entrance into a higher realm, expressing readiness for his heart and soul to join that divine plane. Clearly, his inner turmoil had reached a devastating climax. While Lil Loaded's mama mentioned his emotional state concerning his ex-girlfriend, it's worth noting that Lil Loaded was facing legal consequences too, adding yet another layer of complexity and tragedy to his already troubled journey. Tragic news shook social media on Monday, May 31st, as reports of Lil Loaded's untimely demise surfaced. Although details surrounding the death were scarce, a man who was identified as a friend of the rapper and goes by the name of Syrac claimed that Loaded had 
had taken his own life due to relationship troubles. Expressing his deep anguish, Syrac took to his Instagram story to share a series of heartfelt posts. In one of his initial messages, he wrote, Mutt just killed himself because his bitch, I hate this so much right now. Syrac continued, revealing that Loaded had confided in him at the studio a month prior, expressing his intentions to harm anyone who had been involved with his romantic partner. Tragically, it seemed that Loaded followed through with his words, leaving behind a devastated friend who deeply loved. Some people expressed their sorrow online, showing support for Lil Loaded. Perhaps his girlfriend was the reason why he did it, but it's never that simple. One comment wrote, It's usually not one thing. It's a combination of circumstances that make you want to end it. I've been there, and I know how hard it is when the rain pours. Shake my head. R.I.P. young man. And another comment wrote, He was a combination of everything. I can't even imagine the pain he must have felt accidentally killing his best friend then his girlfriend cheating on him? He probably already had mental health issues, the pressure of the music industry and blowing up so randomly and quickly, and his charges. I feel for him. He clearly had no support system around him either. Such a shame. Rest in peace, Loaded. I hope you're doing good up there. Little Loaded's success story serves as a testament to the power of talent, hard work, and season opportunities. From humble beginnings to becoming a rising star in the Dallas hip-hop scene, he embodied the spirit of perseverance and dedication. With his distinct voice and authentic lyrics, Little Loaded captivated audiences and paved his own path in the music industry. Lil Loaded's story serves as a reminder of the challenges and pressures faced by young artists in the music industry. A tragic loss, but his music remains as a legacy for fans to remember him by.